Axel, five axis machines here on show from Spinner. Um, this one's your best seller, I believe. Yes, the U-Series is our best selling five axis machine, actually. Uh, we produce and sell about 500 machines a year and we have several versions. We have a lot of options, different controls, different spindles, different sizes of machines uh, and different automation also. I mean, we're here at AMB and there's a load of five axis machines around here. Um, how do you make this one kind of different or your offering different? Well, we have uh, a lot of different uh, technical advantages in terms of uh, speed, in terms of precision, in terms of floor space. The machines are extremely compact and uh, we have a lot of advantages upon the competitor and we produce it in a very good price ratio. And you, on this particular model, you've got the, ro the robo box on here. Automation, I'm going around this show and there's so many robots everywhere. It's really important, isn't it, to be able to offer something that keeps this running lights out. Yes, uh, but the difference in our case is we produce all the robot systems by ourselves. It's not a bought-in system. It's fully integrated in the machine. It has a, a, a unique interface which we can give more information between machine and the robot back. For example, program names, we can make one piece only fully automated in different complex uh, work pieces. So it's uh, from one source and automation uh, in that complexity is not available on the market. Uh, how, how often are people buying five axes with automation now then? What, what's your ratio? Uh, let's say depending on the, on the volume they produce, but in generally about 30% of the customers have some kind of automation, let's say simple pallet changers for mold makers, uh, but also more and more robots. Axel, I've seen this machine before and I do like talking about it because I think it's important for our viewers to see, um, you know, not just five axis from you, but the flexibility you offer on five axis. What's different about the U1530 to the U630? Explain. Yes, in generally the U series, the name says universal. That's why it's called U. It's a machine for small batches, for high precision. It's very flexible and has a lot of different versions in the system. So the U5-1530 uh, is basically an extended version with a longer stroke compared to the smaller machine, but offers a unique design with a five axis table in the right side of the working area and a fixed table on the left side, uh, which can be used for average machining, while on the other side, it's a five axis, full five axis machine. So I'm considering this and I'm thinking, this allows me to finish apart completely then. I can machine five faces there and one there. Is that the real advantage? Uh, yes, that's true, but not only. You can make on the fixed table the first operation, turn the part on the five axis table and make the other five surfaces of the workpiece finished. But you can also, over both tables, you can also work with long workpieces up to 1,500 millimeter workpiece lengths in a three axis operation. Uh, so that's uh, the flexibility. You can also swivel up the, the axis, the A axis, and you can have a tailstock on the fixed table and you can work on a shaft type work pieces like a four axis machine. And how popular is this model for you? That's a big percentage of our five axis machine because customers who need in a workshop a three axis machine and a five axis machine, they go only for one machine combined. Maybe they don't have enough pro uh, production output for buying three, two different machines. So they buy one combined machine only and they are fully flexible. Automation on this strikes me as a machine that, that the, would help as well. The same as on the short version, you can have a pallet changer, you can have a robot automation uh, for, uh, to fit work pieces on the five axis table.